Good morning to all of you. This is Ranjan from smartfinancein.com. And this is a very special video, very important video. And if you are involved in the options trading, especially those who are doing the option strategy trade, those who are involved in some kind of option analysis. So for them, this video is very important and very rational. So in this video, what I am going to cover? I am going to cover how you can use the chat GPT like of AI for your option study. So you, many of you will be doing the option studies manually or using some software. However, the AI does an excellent job to analyze this option related stops. So to do that, you need many things. If you are involved in the option trades, you need IV rank, you require IV percentile, you also require a price trend. So you also require volatility skew. So you also require the max pain. So likewise, lot many informations you require and all these informations can be done with the help of the chart GPT in a very simpler way. And I am going to describe each one of those things in this particular presentation. So here, before starting the presentation, I wish to inform you one thing that in our website today, we are going to update the seven advanced WD GAN technique for investment and trade decision webinar. So this is the new webinar, which is going to happen on 16th, 17th November, Saturday, Sunday, again, 23rd, 24th, and on 25th also it is going to happen. And this particular webinar, I'll be using the chart GPT with the GAN method. So these are the topics you'll be learning about GAN hexagon, tetrahedron, six square of nine, using GAN angle with the chart GPT, GAN cycle, GAN triangle and a zero angle method. So all these things will be taught and one session I have kept it for live market. You have to use the chart GPT like AI in the live market along with the GAN study to improvise your things. And this particular information will be updated in our website under the webinar link shortly, shortly, and this is a today day end it will be updated if you want to enroll you can enroll for the program and also we are running very good diwali offers for our courses and softwares if you want you can procure that it will be a very useful tool for you so let me proceed towards the today's topic how we are going to utilize the ai type of tool or chart GPT for our option analysis. So that is what we are going to do. For that, we require a data. So I have just downloaded data from the NSC site, option chain, and October is ending. So I have taken the November options. I have downloaded the CSV file. Then I have slightly updated because you have only one strike here. So I have just call strike and put strike I have made and top some things as there. I have removed that and I have put what are these informations are standing for. So this left side info is standing for the call options, right side for put options. So many where the space was there means call open interest is zero, IV is zero. So I have just changed those parameters to zero, zero, zero. So wherever the missing informations are there, I've just changed it and then after I just trimmed this up, a file, clean this file and post that I am just feeding it to the chat GPT and I am asking a prompt. I am giving a prompt as an expert option analyst, please do a comprehensive option chain analysis and just suggest the price trend for the coming 15 days. Do estimate max pen, IV rank and IV percentile. So after this thing, it is reading these particular things. It is giving me the definition of max pen, IV rank, IV percentile, price trend estimations, everything. However, it has found out certain columns are having some numeric errors and all. It is automatically fixing everything. 
then it is doing a calculations and telling me the max pain is sitting at 25,000 strike. Current IV, the mean implied volatility is 14.1%. IV rank is 40%, 40.33. IV percentile is 65%. So these are the 65% of days. The current IV is above the historic IV. So this is what it is giving me. So then I am just asking the system again, what price movement is expected soon? So then it is going on, adding the same studies, whatever it has done. And it is telling that range bound between 24,800 to 25,200. And it is range bound between these things, slight bullish sentiment, the moderate IV and higher put open interest at lower strike, suggest there are some supports on the downside and market could see a gradual move upward through constrained thought. So these constraints things are there and coming next 15 days, we are having this is the lower level of 24,800 and 25,200 to 300. So this is what it is giving. And when we, all these things is happening, November future is trading at 24,442. But my analysis has not stopped here. I have again asked, please ignore the strike having zero open interest and do a fresh analysis. It has corrected to certain things, but nothing much changed here. And it has given on this thing. Then I have asked, please give a support resistance analysis along with open interest distribution, open interest distribution analysis and volatility skew analysis. So why I did not ask this question in the beginning? Because the data need to be taken, it has to be studied, the system need a training. What you are, data we are giving, the system need to understand, the AI need to understand the system, AI need to go through all your data, correct all your data, give some calculations. Then if you ask somewhat complex questions, it will analyze. So then it has done a support and put options. This is a very higher concept. Put open interest distribution, call open interest distribution. It's meaning volatility skew. So call strikes, these are the strikes is having a distributed open interest. Means higher open interest in their rank points. So as compared to the rank, it has call open interest distributions, which are the strikes are having the call open interest distribution from the lowest to highest, it has given. Highest is having 25,000. Then next highest, 26. Next highest, 25,500. So this is how the call open interest is distributed. However, put options are having a distribution of 24, 23, 23, 500, 24, 500. So put option distribution also given. How it is distributed based on their rank, which is having highest open interest, which is the next highest, which is having third highest like this. Volatility skew also it has found out. It has found out this is the call strikes having a positive volatility skew. And it has given and gone in this order, which if the skew is present, that also it has gone. And somewhere the zero skew is there, somewhere the negative skew also coming. So these are the negative skew is there. So it is also mentioning what is the skew meaning is. So those who are new to the volatility skew, they can read through this. Volatility skew helps identifying if there is a higher demand for put or call based on difference in implied volatility across the strike price. The skew towards put means higher put IV indicates more fear. The skew towards call shows more greed or bullish sentiment. So this is how skew is being translated. Every strikes skew it has given positive zero negative skew. Based on that, it has support and resistance it has given. Open interest distribution also given. So this volatility skew analysis also given. So then I am asking the system based on the above volatility skew analysis, what will be the immediate price trend? See my 
फ्लो ऑफ माई क्वेरी और फ्लो ऑफ माई प्रॉम्प्ट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फर्स्ट आई आस्क टू स्टडी द चेन इट देन आई हैव आस्क दैट सम इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग्स यू नीड टू डू इन दिस पर्टिकुलर चेन देन आई एम आस्किंग सम वोलाटाइलिटीज क्यू एडवांस थिंग्स यू हैव टू स्टडी फ्रॉम द ऑप्शन चेन देन आई एम आस्किंग वाट विल बी द इमीडिएट प्राइस ट्रेंड सो हिया price trend i am coming into and this is telling that 24 and 25 this is the broadest range so short term bearish pressure and volatility skew is negative at higher strike it shows bullish sentiment with the trader anticipating upward move so this is negative skew also present immediate price trend 25000 positive skew support 24 conclusion it is deriving then what will be the price point which will confirm a reversal based on the volatility skew so it is giving 25000 above if it is the moving then we can say there is a reversal if the price fall below 24000 then there will be a bullish reversal or you can say that negative trend will continue so this breakout about 25000 and fall below 24000 this is very important for us then it is going for i am asking is a breakout above 25000 is likely or it is having the chances then it has given all this analysis and these are the things i am just cross verifying all these things sentiment momentum everything it is talking about breakout scenario it is talking about range bound scenario it is talking about what level i should be bearish back down also happen that also it is talking about all this discussions or the all the prompt writing is going on and i am getting all those informations and here after many steps here after many steps i come to my original prompt based on the above analysis please suggest three best option strategy for coming 15 days of holding make a choice of the strategy which will have moderate risk high reward potential so moderate risk and high reward potential so that will be my choice and it is giving me the things one bear put spread moderate risk and high reward then it is giving long strangle i can go for strikes also it is choosing then it is talking about iron condor moderate risk balance reward so three things it has given however this uh, this is not the end of the things again i am moving up and up can you simulate the bear put spread so bear put spread simulate at different different levels and it is giving me the simulations if nifty goes to 25000 or 25100 70 point of losses will be there so you have to Rupees seventy per lot, max loss four hundred thirty rupees per lot. So this is how it is. Lot means it is taking about one quantity. So you need to change the quantity to seventy five to get it break even. Everything it gives. Could you simulate iron condor? So that also simulated, and its value given. Again, can you simulate the straddle? If for fifteen days, all these simulations are happening for the fifteen days period. what will be the probable price points will happen based on that it is simulating but i am not i am not accepting that things now then and the last phase of my prompt i have given the price chart of the nifty nifty price chart november future price chart i have given please study this price chart given above and synchronize the study with the option chain and improve the price trend analysis and recommend the option strategy so after this study what happens it has given a trends what time the trend has started where it is going synchronize with the option chain after that refine option strategy so he is telling taking about the ai is telling that bear put spread remain valid so this out of this three bear put spread remain valid again it says that iron condor for the enhanced and here selling a put buying a put sell a call 
put everything it has given and to break beyond 25000 long straddle long straddle is what it has suggested earlier it is telling that now it is slightly riskier conclusion it is saying that most recommended is bear put second iron condor last long stranded should should only be considered if there is a exception in of increasing volatility and potential breakout so this is how it helps so here the five minutes of exercise to understand the option chain to calculate various various important parameters out of that and synchronize with the chart study and to finalize on a option strategy with a lot of simulations as is only happening with a five minute of job you question me now can everyone do these things whether all traders are having that capacity to do these things no it is not possible for everyone can anyone who is viewing this video and just giving the prompt like this way can get benefited out of this no they cannot get benefited out of that the reason is we need to understand the fundamental of all these things we need to know what is option skew or volatility skew we need to know what are the options other parameters use of iv rank iv percentile max pen i have not gone to the greek analysis i have not asked any prompt here which speaks about delta which speaks about theta which speaks about omega so i have not asked the system to give me a delta neutral approach theta neutral approach or vega neutral approach or any such kind of combination approach this is just a simple way to make you understand how you can use the chat gpt type of ai for your benefit you cannot ask everything at a stretch you cannot ask that option chain you can take you can take pictures of price chart and analyze everything and give it to me you'll be get fooled the system has to take the option chain start somewhere either it has to take the price chart or it has to take the option chain any one do a study in that then it will slowly slowly refine and go for that that is why it is known as prompt what is a prompt prompt is not a question and neither a debate prompt is neither a question nor a debate so it is a combination of both you are discussing you are having few questions you are giving some informations and all these together things is known as a prompt and by this process the advanced traders are moving in that direction so now question comes how you will prepare yourself to be in that group or in that club of advanced traders so only way out is you need to learn the basics to advance concepts of option strategy you need to know each terms terminology its use its benefits its drawbacks everything so this is where your study comes into picture not only you have to study you have to remember that things then only you can able to ask to the chat gpt so all these things are available in our course on futures and options and using this you can form excellent prompts you can get lot of insights from the option strategy improvise your trade with ai solution and make your trades profitable for you so utilize this particular diwali offer to procure the courses and softwares and make use of them thank you very much thank you for your time